choice to be self-reliant has created everything. As opposed to God-reliant. As opposed to God-reliant. That's the original thing. You could call that, if you want to use a biblical term, The reason why is because when you become self-reliant, you now need to decide in yourself what is harmonious with love and disharmonious with love and so forth. And of course you're not going to be connected to God. Connection with God is about being God-reliant and, and receiving things from God, receiving truth from God. Self-reliance is about, I want to hold on to my own truth. And many of you here today feel like that, if you're honest with yourself. You want to hold on to your own truth. You don't like what you're hearing. Right? A lot of you don't like what you're hearing, right? You want to hold on to your own truth. You're allowed to. You don't have to listen to this insane man, right? You're allowed to hold on to your own truth. But I'm saying to you, that is the original sin, if you like. That is the original cause of all this disharmony that we have on the earth today was caused by every single person wanting to hold on to their own truth. Right? Let's just change it for a moment. Let's just imagine a world where every single person wants God's truth. How different is that world going to be? It's going to be totally different, isn't it? Totally different. Because now we're not self-reliant, we're God-reliant. So what's going to happen? As we're God-reliant, we're getting closer to God and closer to God. What else will happen? We get closer to each other, don't we? Isn't that what happens too? Right? So what's caused all this separation is because each one of us wants to be self-reliant. I want to determine my truth, thank you. I want to determine what happens in my life, thank you. I want to control what's going on in my world. So as all these species were developed on the earth, it was like us in a survival Instincts. Can you feel what's going on inside of your soul at the moment? Um, intellectual sort of trying to work out. There is, there is this feeling of confusion. Can you feel that? Why are you asking all of these intellectual questions? Let yourself feel that. Why? What do you want? I'm thinking back to God and nothing on earth. And so he had, you know, trying to um, realise God has no emotions, no anger, no... I never said that. <laughs> what did I say? So I'm oh, picturing um, all things bright and beautiful, all creatures, great and small, just everything absolutely harmoniously blissful on yep. earth until that survival instinct came and they all started eating each other. No, until man came and started eating them. That's what happened. Like, what I'm saying is, God is totally emotional. Totally an emotional being. God is not, definitely not, detuned from emotion. What do you think love is? Isn't it an emotion? Yes, no, what it is, I'm not talking about the no, God doesn't have any negative emotions. What you would classify as negative emotions. God doesn't feel rage or anger. Why would why would she? Everything she created is perfect. Would you be angry if everything was perfect? That's why I was picturing that. You asked me a question and I was actually picturing to the beginning, the creation. Everything was perfect. Everything was bright and beautiful, creatures. And this is what created everything different. And there was no negativity until the survival instinct. No, it's not the survival instinct. It was this. Self -reliance it was this. Self-reliance is almost like um, survival. No. Um, that's what I was thinking. No, they're not the same thing. So for, what's survival instinct? There is, like, I'm saying everything is based around self-reliance, that things have gone bad, everything. It's based around me wanting to hold on to my truth, you wanting to hold on to yours, so Joe Blow wanting to hold on to his, and we're all willing to disagree and argue and even fight and even go to war for it. Right? That's what's caused what we've got now. 
Right? If we all became God reliant, what would happen? I would have to give up my truth. You would have to give up your truth. And we would all eventually have God's truth. Does that mean we're all robots still? No, because we've all got different personalities, unique, and in amongst this beautiful, large universe God created, you have the ability to do anything you want, harmonious with love. And in fact, once you've got rid of that as the biggest emotion, you will want to do everything harmonious with love. And you'll enjoy that.